Oh, hey, how's it going? Not so bad. Yourself? Good. Anyway, I've owned a Google TV now for about, I want to say, a year and a bit. I've always had this one problem with Google TV. Putting it on pause for a long duration of time will make it go to the screensaver and then reset the application that I'm watching. For instance, I'm watching a Netflix movie. Whatever movie, doesn't matter. All of a sudden, I got a cramp in my stomach. I got to go unleash freaking dirt snake in the old plumbing. So what do I normally do? What everybody else does. Grab your cell phone, go down to the throne, sit down for half an hour, do your business in five minutes, watch memes for the other 25. Right? Right. By the time I come back up here, go to hit play on my freaking Netflix again to watch it. It's got a kick out of the screensaver. I'm back at the main menu of Netflix. I got to go find the video that I want to watch again because the screensaver mode resets the application you're watching. It does it with YouTube, does it with Netflix, does it with Prime Video, does it with the Plex app, even does it with VLC. Freaking annoying. One feature that they don't give you on the Google Home or the Google TV, sorry, Google TV, not Google Home, is to turn off screensaver mode. But wait, they do. And I'm going to show you how. Even though I make tech videos, I'm keeping this here pretty basic because, um, you know, that's how I do things. So you're going to want to come over here to the right to the settings. It's going to bring you into settings. Now, I've already done the the, uh, the fix, but I'm going to show you here how to do it. You're going to come down here to system. You're going to go to about. You're going to come all the way down here to the Android TV OS build, and you're going to click it one, two, three, four, five, six, seven times. Right now, you see it's telling me that I don't need to because I'm already a developer. But this is going to turn developer mode on. Once that's all said and done, you're going to go back to the system screen. You're going to scroll down here to developer options. And you're going to turn on stay awake. And that will prevent your Google Home from launching the screensaver mode. That will cause this problem. Because unfortunately, you're probably saying, well, why don't you just go turn off the screensaver? It's called ambient mode. You have two options, start now or settings. If you go into settings, the options you have are start now, Google Photos, Art Gallery, or Experimental, which... Who knows where they pull that data from. You can have it show the weather, the time, the device information, personal photo data, portrait Google Photos, personal photo curations, and you can pick the speed of the slideshow. You cannot pick a start time. You cannot pick a screen saver start in 15 minutes time. None of that. It starts when it wants to. You have no control over this. But with my little setting fix, now you do. You can finally turn the damn thing off, which is what I did. I just tested it. I had to go and unleash Fury on the old plumbing system there. And when I came back, my screen was paused at the exact location on a YouTube video without scrolling through screenshots of memes that I post on Facebook. It was brilliant. It was awesome. And I greatly, greatly appreciate discovering this. So there you go. That's how you turn off the screensaver feature on your Google TV. If you have one of these and that thing annoys you, just enable developer mode. Go turn that stupid thing off. All right, guys. Until next time. Peace the frig out. Sit, stupid, sit. Good dog.